broadly speaking, when you get markets that are well extended in one direction, it doesn't take much to trigger moves the other way. We had been seeing a lot of demand for stocks and selling of the U.S. dollar, and this had set up the expectation that a turnaround was to be expected. We think the combination of a lot of good news being priced in around the globe, U.S. yields pushing up on account of rising inflation, and renewed worry around the coronavirus have all contributed to this latest downturn in sentiment and dollar demand. Key standouts on today's calendar include UK inflation reads, a BOE Bailey speech, Canada inflation data, and the Bank of Canada policy decision. That's all for now.